there are 20 year veterans of law enforcement agencies turning in their badge today because they refuse to bow the knee to tyranny. There are nurses who studied and trained for years, plunging themselves into debt to fulfill, fulfill their dream of caring for others. Only now to have the government strip them of their jobs because of a virus that they were themselves committed to defeating. I barely recognize America anymore, Madam Chairman. You and your colleagues have sacrificed freedom on the altar of safety. Forced injections mandated by the federal government is nothing short of subsidized medical apartheid. Something must be done. Today, I'm introducing a bill to address this tyranny head on. The Justice for All Businesses Act will stop this joke, will stop Joe Biden's overreach in its tracks. The JAB Act stri strips the Secretary of Labor from using funds to enforce a mandate, not a law, a fake mandate, forcing employees to be vaccinated against COVID-19. It also prohibits the federal government from raining down fines on businesses for upholding the Constitution and defying tyrannical edicts. My bill will not be the end of the matter. I promise to keep working until Washington bureaucrats once again know who they truly work for. This is not a matter of health. It's a matter of liberty. The right to work is innately American. When you strip away someone's livelihoods, you rob them of their freedom. You rip away their identity. You tarnish their, 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 their dignity. There are patriots across this nation who would rather see their jobs ripped away from them than lose their right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. I stand with them to defend freedom at all costs.